We have a girl. A girl. A daughter. A girl. I'm very proud of you. I'm proud of both of us. We had a girl. <laughs> a baby girl. Sam, I'm a father. And I'm a mother. I thought you two had that all worked out. Now, would you like to hold your daughter? Oh, isn't she beautiful? I think she's beautiful. Don't get too close. And don't sit on the bed. Hi there. Honey, don't you think we ought to do something about her name? Darling, what do you think of Tabitha? T Tabitha? Your old man has to go to work. Darren, mm -hmm. you haven't apologized to her for accusing her of being a full-blooded witch. Now, you know that's impossible. Why? Her mother's a witch. But you're not. You're mortal. So the most she can be is a half-blooded witch. You're right. I apologize. Now, Tabitha, I want you to do that test. And I certainly hope you flunk it. I think. Now. You can't get that pretty pony, can you, Tabitha? Can you get the pretty pony? <laughs> She can't get the pretty pony. Pretty pony. She can get the pretty pony. Isn't that fun, Tabitha? <laughs> Would you care to take the Busby off? Or are you more comfortable with it on? It's a shame we can't make you talk. But as long as you understand, I suppose you'll do. Now, look. The juice is in the refrigerator. She takes it at 11, and she naps at 1. And if there's anything you need, just ring, and I'll pop right back. All right? <laughs> Have fun, love bug. Juice. Drink. story. Do you think it's a good idea reading to Tabitha about goblins and creatures? Oh, sweetheart, don't be silly. She loved it. loved it too much. Now, darling, we agreed that Tabitha was going to have a normal, mortal Halloween, just like any other child in the neighborhood, didn't we? That's right. Well, so I just read her an ordinary little mortal Halloween story. There's no harm. <laughs> and tomorrow night, her ordinary daddy and her... Ordinary mommy are going to take her trick-or-treating. Cute, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It'll be your first time. <laughs> Mine, too. <laughs> oh, Mother would have a fit. Uh, speaking of your mother, uh, where is she? Oh, she flew to the south of France. She's hiding out till Halloween blows over. <laughs> well, that makes it official. A normal, mortal Halloween. <laughs> Make me. Help! Mom! 
Michael's frustration scream. Mommy! 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 Get me out of here! Tabitha! <laughs> what happened? She locked me in a cage and took away my wagon. There's an example of the imagination of a child with a free spirit. <laughs> Fantastic. Tabitha, give Michael back his wagon. I'm terribly sorry. Forget it. Let's finish our coffee. Tabitha hasn't learned to share, has she? <laughs> Like you. I don't like you. I wish I was a doggy. Why? So I could bite you to pieces. <laughs> I wish I was a doggy. I wish so too. <laughs> Tabitha. Excuse me, Mrs. Birch, only there she goes. <laughs> Not a giant, I am the giant. And who in tarnation are you? My name is Tabitha. <laughs> There's no Tabitha in this story. There is now. Do you know why? Yes, because you're a witch. You wish your very own special mommy who spoils you rotten to go away. <laughs> <laughs> and remember, real mommies sometimes have to say no, but it still means I love you, OK? Okay, Mommy. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Keith and Dorothy just arrived, and Dorothy's on her way up here. Mommy and Daddy are here? Yeah, so, so we better hurry. But if you take away the dots, we won't be sisters anymore. Tabitha, you can be sisters without looking alike. But that girl in the park says that Lisa and me can't be sisters because I'm white and she's black. That's right, Mrs. Stevens. That's what she said. Well... She was wrong. Sisters are girls who share something. Usually the same parents, but if you share other things, good feelings, friendship, love, the way you two do, well, that makes you sisters in another way. I'm sure you'll do your best to cook the things that Darren likes. But perhaps I'd better give you the recipes for some of the favorite dishes of his. <laughs> You'd better let go of me. What if I don't, huh? What if I don't? You'll see, you big bully. Me, why I wouldn't hurt a fly? Maybe not, but you're going to love eating them, you... you big bully frog. <laughs> and don't forget the... Tabitha. You're the first frog freak I've ever met, so I'm not just sure how to deal with you. But let's begin by putting the frog back in the terrarium. But this frog isn't the frog you think it is. Tabitha, the terrarium. <laughs> 